While almost 48,000 started today's 49th Berlin Marathon, three athletes stood out from the pack, each for the best and for spectacular reasons. Conditions were perfect, 14 degrees centigrade and no wind. Tigist Asefa of Ethiopia was to set a women's world record by over two minutes. Amanal Petros lit up German hearts by improving his own national record by almost one and a half minutes. And the living legend Eliud Kipchoge of Kenya delivered yet again, racking up a unique fifth Berlin victory. Three, two, one. At 9.15 a.m. adjacent to the Tiergarten, the first wave of the 47,912 entrants from 156 nations got underway in these glorious conditions. Everything suggested a special day was coming from their start on the 17th June Strasse. Kipchoge had set the world record here last year, but there were question marks over his name. He'd had a bad run for sixth place in Boston last April. The usual pack of pacemakers set them off from the start line at world record tempo, much as last year. The masses flock to Berlin for its fast, flat course and year after year near perfect conditions. Following paces, he reached halfway in 60.22 a more sensible pace than last year. His only company was quickly reduced to Derse Kinde of Ethiopia, a 208 athlete from last year's Barcelona Marathon. This was a shock. There were question marks over Kinde. Nobody really knew how good he could be. And he matched Kipchoge stride for stride through to 30 kilometers. The more conservative split at halfway looked to be setting things up well. And Kipchoge started to look mortal. But Kinde dropped back and then very quickly dropped out at around 31 kilometers. And yet again, the emperor of marathon running was on his own. However, he started to look mortal. A new world record slipped from his grasp as he slowed and a chasing pack of three started closing, including two debutantes. They got close, but not close enough. And as he reached in the last five kilometers, so they got no closer than 31 seconds. The pressure was on, but he responded and accelerated in the final kilometers. Through the Brandenburg Gate and into the sunshine, a familiar role for this extraordinary athlete, twice an Olympic champion and five times a Berlin Marathon. His winning time, 2.02.42. Only two men in history had gone quicker than this, other than Kipchoge himself. The women's race promised a great deal with seven athletes on the start line having broken the 220 barrier. However, last year's champion Tigista Sefa of Ethiopia was back. She set a course record by over two minutes in 2022 and there was rumour that she wanted to break the world record in Berlin this time round. The early tempo was sensible, fast but sensible and it wasn't until between 10 and 15 kilometers that she got inside world record splits. One or two athletes tried to go with her, Worknesha Dessa, her compatriot, for the early kilometers. But very soon, it was just she against the clock, of course, accompanied by her male pacemakers. Edessa, a 2.18 athlete, started glancing behind and that's always a telltale sign. Asefa was focused only on those around her. And very soon, those included not one other female as she dominated the race from before halfway. From that point on, it was just the Ethiopian 29-year-old against the clock. Because it was a mixed race, she had paces with her the whole way, a huge assistance, but that is the norm these days. At 20 kilometers, 
Her time was 41 seconds inside world record tempo and things were looking good. Last year, she won seven of her eight races, including a storming, comfortable victory on these same roads of the German capital. This year, there was a real sense of deja vu, but for the fact she was running two or three minutes quicker. As the race wore on and the sun broke out through the second half, so that target of 2.12 started to look possible. And by the time she reached Brand the Brandenburg Gate, it was indeed possible. It became clear that a sub 2.12 clocking was on the cards. She would lift more than two minutes from the world record of Bridget Koskai, set in Chicago in 2019. As the crowd roared louder and louder, she, so she got quicker and quicker towards the finish line. Eventually smashing through the tape in a truly legendary time. Hard to believe, but she crossed the line faster than a Bebe Bikila's winning Olympic time, a world record back in 1964. A new world record had been set. Her time, 2.11.53. In the men's race, the big hope was Amanal Petros, the 28-year-old, running his seventh marathon and already the German record holder. After weeks of training in Kenya, he stated he wanted to improve his own national record. His year had gone well. He won the Hanover Marathon back in March in 207. But this was the big one, in perfect conditions. Last year, fourth in the European Championships in Munich. Today, mixing it with the very world's best. Petros was confident. His preparation had gone supremely. The European record might have been a tough target, but something under 205 was what he wanted. He runs for the local Berlin club. He knew the support would be huge on the streets around him. And Petros, knowing that the likes of Kipchoge would be too fast for him, ran a very, very smart race. He was in the chasing pack throughout and in the latter stages stayed strong, well inside the top 10 with the best of the East Africans around him. A new German record and an Olympic qualifying time was his target and both looked set to come his way. As he approached the line in ninth place, the clock showed under 2.05 He'd achieved his goal. He'd improved his own German record. The roars were perhaps louder for him than for anybody. And he knew his good day's work was done. In the women's race for Germany, Dominika Meyer set a new personal best and an Olympic qualifying time, coming home again to loud roars from the domestic crowd in 2.23.47. She too should have booked her slot for Paris. Well, the 1-2-3 in the men's race was again dominated by the East Africans. A safest performance, the one of the day. A new world record on this 49th edition of the BMW Berlin Marathon. A spectacular day in the sunshine on the streets of the German capital.